And we're gonna go for English. I said English. Oh, of course. This game contains uh, scenes of violence and grotesque imagery and biological violence. What do you mean about that? Well, you remember that kind of strike next on zombies. The zombies actually reminded me of something else. I know, I know. Sometimes I agree that I'm too stuck on the past at times. Deep space. These guys actually. I didn't know much about these guys, but they went, let's say, bankrupt. They're not around anymore. Sadly. Okay. It's gonna be a bit, might be a problem. are made of. Yes, yes sir. sir! Mission code name is Cold Limit. What? Check the mission data on your remote, ter no, remote terminal. Terminal. Yes, sir! Dennis? Hmm. I don't know what you're thinking. Really? I can't stop you from worrying about the past. Everybody does it sometimes. Just remember one thing. What? Be strong. You know? Keep focused. Don't let your mind become clouded. Something I learned on the streets. With life comes pain. You gotta deal with it. Look, Roger, I know you're right. But if it turns... Dad, that Cindy's in trouble. Cindy. I swear to protect her with my life. I'll do whatever it takes. God's sake, it's the only thing I can do for him now. For Andrew. Pretty edgy, I know. Hey, okay, remember? You, me, and Andrew made these out of shrapnel. After that mission in China. You remember the R&R &R in Bangkok? Huh? Well, times are rough. Now look at this. And I remember. That I've got good friends. We weren't just a team. We were like family. Never forget that. My it was my body too, you know. I understand. Thanks, Roger. Something blew up. No. Now, like I was saying again, this game here is actually uh, <laughs> extermination. Hold on, let me just see what what I can do here. Vibration off, sound stereo, just screen. Yeah, because this damn thing's shaking. Well, give me a second. There you go. Okay, everything here is good for the time being, that is. Brightness. Okay. But like I was saying, this game actually. It looks cool and everything, but don't get me wrong. This game was actually, you know, by review, was a piece of shit, but. Actually, as a kid, I played this. I played this game some time ago. And if it's the same intro, we might as well skip. Oh yeah, December 2005. Yeah, we, we already seen that one. That uh, then thing blows up and yeah, that's loading screen. What the fuck oh, here! Where are you now? Uh, right above me. <laughs> the air duct is here. It should leave into the compound. First, get your ass up here. Come on! This ice cliff looks impossible. You'll have to find a way around it. Just follow my directions. 
the elevator. Okay. All right. But like I said, uh, like I was saying too, this game is like a, it's. Uh, here we go. This game is actually pretty cool in many ways and whatnot. But again, ah, thank you. Yeah, I'll need it. Okay, thank you. Back. But. Okay. SPR4. Okay, I'm just making sure here that I that I know everything. Is my uh, SPR4, also known as the M4, right? Let's go. Yeah, it's like a, pu a cute little red dot sight, isn't it? I know the game. The damn game here is actually quite uh, heavy, or not? Lower stock scope, select the MA parts, which is actually a. I'd say it's like it's like an M4, but it's not a. It's a, except it's not. Even got here the handguard too, and return the main menu because yeah. Now the frame rate, I know it isn't all that good, but I mean there's nothing much you can do about it. And here you got the database screen. And for Dennis, task manual, cold limit. What does it mean? That's an okay. Top secret mission, security level five. Confidential internal documents. Destination Southwest Antarctica. The military compound, Fort Stewart. Mission type reconnaissance with heavy firearms equipment. Operation file number one from the Pentagon. 72 hours ago, we received a request by an identified person demanding aerial bombing for targeting their compound. Communication was lost after the request after the regular four hour interval transmission of also ceased too. A platoon recon from the USMC uh, Special Reconnaissance Forces will dispatch the uh, C-17 in one hour. Special equipment provided, Arctic region. Special combat suits, ultimate suits, NGS-2. Uh, Operation Fall 2 from the Pentagon. The C-17E, uh, I'm sorry, I mean, the C-17E will refuel it at the Escondido Air Force Base in Argentina and will then proceed to Fort uh, Stewart. Security team will parachute from 2,000 meters directly to Fort. The rendezvous point is ground level B wing and wait for the troops to rally. Uh, begin investigation, the personnel, secure personnel and wait for rescue helicopter. During the operation, swift action should be taken to overcome any emergency. This connection, uh, in this connection, human lives are too co are considered to be expendable. Oh. Operation File 3 from the Pentagon. The highest priority should be given to the regarding control of the compound. The security operation is absolutely top secret, must not be leaked to outsiders. Simplify. You got here the uh, SP4, which of course people I know are going to be curious about. SPR4 stands for Special Purpose uh, Rifle and the new uh, assault rifle model, which is commonly equipped by USMC Special Reconnaissance Forces Recon. Also, or also known as the M4, but I might be wrong. The, the rifle is independently created by the Recon. An updated version is a saw rifle used by SOCOM, U.S. Special Operation, uh, U.S. Special Operation Command at the end of the 20th century, so 2000. Okay. Choose your preferred shooting style, semi-automatic or three-shot burst. By chain selector, many screens. So it's like the M16 and M4 at the same time. Well, the dreadful three-shot, not fully auto, but I mean, I can do with it. The, atta he, the attachment of custom parts allow the extensive upgrades to the SPS 4 capability. Parts allow fully automatic fi Oh! Fully automatic firing, flame thrower capability, and much more. Okay. The SPR 4 features dramatically boost the fighting efficiency of the individual soldier. The integral parts have been revamped, improving hit accuracy and decreasing the recoil. Through the use of uh, RUS Recon Universal Socket, we have enabled a quick universal attachment of the myriads of the special devices. Huh, okay. We also got the Ultra Suits, which I how the hell if I know what they are. But again, I mean, from, my, from the last time I played this game here, the models are a little bit different too. I mean, I think I got this game... Uh, I think it was from I mean the version I got it was from Australia. I mean that's when the uh, where the uh, the emulator showed the location of it. But all right, 
you got here the ultra suits now official name NGS2 next generation all round suit was developed in 2002 by adaptive armaments and incorporations a US weapons company and then the commission Navy SEALs team dev formerly team, team 6 uh, the suit's been created with extensive spiral fibers created the ultimate protective uh, combat suits so I should be much more protective I got it right the soldier suit at the NGAS is prepared to face the severest of hostile environments the post and the post cold war era uh, you the US Department of Defense uh, formed the SOCOM to co-op with the increased incidents of regional low-intensity conflicts and local wars okay Terrorism and whatnot. The massive SOCOM budgets uh, made a possible R&D for previous and imaginable equipment and armed projects. Well, one of the first uh, foremost projects to uh, evolve designed the suits would uh, allow special force to of their operatives to execute missions in Arctic, in Arctic desert and tropical regions with minimal environmental distractions. Okay. On duty seals were involved in the testing fire testing during the development of the stages. The initial prototypes completed after two years. The next generation suits were excellent ventilation, water resistant, are bulletproof even, even against medium arms. Not again heavy arm because it's not it's not Master Chief from Halo, Jesus Christ. Okay, so what else? The t design of the t Type 1 Ultra suits emphasizes ventilation and waterproof properties, while the Type suit combines stems of one properties protection of Arctic conditions ah seals were to were to first integrate the ultra suits into regular operations after nearly all US special forces unitly quickly follow the seals lead nice now the Arctic the Antarctic weather conditions okay this is uh, like the uh, geographical details of the uh, nearby missions oh wait there's more even more here. Uh huh. Okay, I'm no scientist for that. Okay. Entering the compound. Entering Fort Stewart. Go to the air deck where Roger's waiting. Okay, I'm apart from that. We apart from that, we already know. Either map. Now I can't really tell. I mean, how 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 let's say things change from time to time over here. But for one, I'm gonna tell you that I think it was a Mark One suit that I wore. I don't know. Maybe things could have gone easier. I also don't know. But one thing I can tell you for sure is that the game here mostly. Uh, for one, let's begin with the character itself. You can see Spinny. First off, I remember the suit actually, you know, was a little bit more bulkier than this one too. I mean much more armor plating around. At least I do know I look like a Terminator I-950, which hell, that's that's my fa <laughs> Okay, never mind. Uh, okay, we also we also got the hairstyle too, which uh, the one the version I played. He was a uh, had a much more longer hair too. Hells and everything here seems to be okay. I'm gonna at least uh, go here with the SPR4 selector. I'm gonna keep it. Uh, Okay, single single fire. Good, good. I mean, in case the things got really nasty, I'm all switch out over here. But until then, until then, gonna be what it's gonna be. So, all right. So let me see if I remember everything. Yeah, you can definitely see like a, you can definitely feel like a some property of the Resident Evil Four, without a doubt. Like a, you know the laser sights and everything. Of course, you got everything here all set up here, but nothing's nothing doing. This here is the, the, the first person view. We're actually looking through the red dot side, but you can see the barrel of the gun there looks uh, questionable, I'd say. And yes, it's like a very per bad run. Okay, this is used to use the power proceed, of course. Okay, it's gone now. Good. Okay, so it's V. Okay, V is like a... Okay, and... This, okay, I'll keep that in mind. There's like the menu. Uh-huh. 
Okay, at least I want to see even at least something where the camera is focusing the player on the character. Okay. Okay then. Let's see. Nothing works. Okay, so it's definitely X, or as I said out here, the space. To be the action figure here, action command here too. And also some people might be asking around here too. If it's the Antarctica, then how the bloody hell the aren't the guys here just freezing to death or not? Because let's face it, even in the Antarctica, characters will say would have his face uh, flesh being ripped off. We're gonna take the damn thing. Okay, so we already got it. Woohoo! There are a lot of things to explore here too. That's just like a uh, some regular thing here too. Now, to be truthful, I have no clue how to jump and everything. And... Okay. Okay. Off we go, then. Fucking jump! Okay. I like the action jump, too. I want to jump. We got here, there's like a cinch over here, too. Now, the cinch over here, it, it's gonna take everyone here once the part is back online. So, I mean, there's actually uh, some good things to actually avoid it, or actually kill it. If you want to avoid it, actually hide underneath it. If you want to kill it, you simply slash the wire off it. As basic as anyone can ever get. And just like the classic Resident Evils, it doesn't matter where, what door you enter, you're only going to be greeted with a loading screen. But I chose to do that, because, hey, I got this damn thing here, which, you know, we're going to need it definitely for sure. I kind of have an idea how the, how well they set up the thing or whatnot. I well, gotta move on. But again, mostly, I'm not one most just to design this the overall performance of the game or not because, hey, I mean, I'm I'm classical gamer myself. I like it to let's say see the game mostly about the how what was the general idea of it. Recorded by George Halen. It's freezing, totally freezing. The blizzard here from early morning that already reached class day. The wind chill is clearly hitting us really hard. Uh huh. What else? I suppose it's. I suppose the cold here is nothing to be surprised after all. Each meter second, the wind lowers. The temperature goes by one. I didn't expect any of this last night when the snow was light. Snow was light. We saw a green flash and a beautiful light pillar. This place is out of order. Antarctica and everything is completely utterly insane. Uh, all the way. Uh, give me a second. This damn thing is freeze. Okay. All the way. All the way. All the way down is the red compound. We will ne we'll never be able to exterminate them. Why do you mean exterminate? Doesn't matter. We we'll just figure that out over time. I mean, after all, the game is still 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 uh, at start, so you know. It's gonna be, let's say, like a hybrid between Red and Evil 4 and all the kind of the previous classic version of it, or hey, I mean, who knows? Who knows? Yo. From there, walk across the gas pipe to the other side. I can't really tell if the pop Just like training, huh, buddy? I wouldn't call it really training, but alright. <laughs> you said it! Now with the analog stick, things are I'm a little... Get a hurry up! You have to fight and <laughs> I really love my graphical, my GPU, I'll tell you that. If you want, you can actually escape to us. Oh, what the hell do I call it? Hurry the fucking hell up, will ya? We don't have all time here. Because even if I need to, I'll even lower the damn things even a whole lot more too. I'm my ass off waiting for ya. One false step, you'll be in trouble. They won't find the body till the poles mount. Nice. 
Okay, can I actually move Have on now? Key across the pipes. There are two places you need to jump. Two places I need to jump. You're not as big as me, so it won't be too hard. Okay, so I have like a bigger agility, huh? Is that what you're trying to say? Okay, good lord. We're okay, gonna have to jump. Roger. The goddamn cutscene is literally a pain in the ass to hit a handle, isn't it? Look, if the damn thing actually keeps on moving, keeps on lagging like this, I'm gonna actually go to the debugging place of this here. And you know what I'm gonna do? That's right. I'm gonna hit. I'm gonna hit the. Uh, hit the damn thing to go even lower than already is. Because hey, I mean, GPU is a piece of shit here. Actually, you know what? Give me a second. Actually, you know what? Never mind. Fucking move it! One thing that I'm actually quite terrified about. Okay, oh. Okay, so. Okay, I know how, how nerve wracking this might be and everything. I got an idea. I'm gonna, aim there. I'm gonna use the aim here to put in the camera over here, and uh, there you go. He didn't really tell about up here or well, not, so might as well just get into it. Because I'm curious. Especially see what supply I'm gonna find up top here, because hey, I mean, supplies are gonna be pretty goddamn scarce. And let the good lord not let me not fall down here. So what do you got here? Okay, full life recovery. This here, <laughs> totally worth coming up here for. That's what I'm sure. I can't really say if I, if you know, a game like this when you can actually fall down or whatnot. But I'm just gonna say you can fall down. I'm not gonna really stress it too much, but you know. Proper reasons for that, even. And you can see here, but uh, but the but the, uh, but the game, but the level formation here that you know, it's a place will definitely come back sometime soon in the game. Do something, probably a boss battle, something. I have no clue. And then by this, let's say memory lagging up on video memory, well not. I believe I would better off be taking like what a Dreamcast. Uh, Emulator? Or a Mega Drive emulator? I don't know. I've gotta jump the gap, huh? Not a problem. Mind the gap, as people say, right? Okay, here we go. Ready? One, two, three. Here goes fucking nothing. Hey, that wasn't so bad. Go. Only choice is to jump this one. I have no choice but to jump this one. Who thought this would be actually a good idea to just do? Fuck. Okay, we actually made it. Now, one thing. So this is the air duct, huh? I was checking out how this Fire fan one. works. It runs for three seconds. Mm hmm. Followed by a two-second pause. Uh-huh. But with the slowdown, it's only clear for one second. We don't have much time. You better go ahead. Me first. I'll go once you safely in. Hey, you're good at this stuff. Am I? Then again, this guy here has an M249, so why don't you just shoot the fucking thing out of it? Slow down. Okay, fuck off! Hey! You, that was close! Almost got my ass chewed up over there.
The only way in? Okay, I hear ya. Now remember, things that are on this map here might be a bit of a hellhole sooner or later. And I get it, I mean, this might be even, this might even be heavier than Jack and Dexter. Doesn't feel right. Trusting your instincts again? Kept me alive so far. Let's look around. There may be some survivors. And you gotta find Cindy. It's locked, huh? Not a problem Let's for me. Let's check out what we can. We'll start here. Back me up. <laughs> I knew he was gonna do that. Ugh, nobody here. I'll take a look around. You wanna search the corridor? Okay. Like you said again, like it's uh, gonna be like the classical Resident Evil, so... You gotta keep in mind for a lot of detail or not here, this place. There's gonna be a lot of things to even worry to even look around. Like, uh... Jesus Christ, even the damn thing is inverted too. Hold on. Yeah, this is the pause menu. Get the base screen, items. I'm very clips. Use jump, remember parents upon training. Okay. That was the only training I got from, from there on out. Then again, if I own like a biz, a uh, game studio. I definitely remake this to like a what a Call of Duty or or what? I don't know anything. Then again, I say Call of Duty because hey, I mean Call of Duty. Let's say you have the ones. Let's say that's like a shoot up and damn thing or not. Until let's see what most of the first print shooter are known of. The safe terminal, the PQAS, is a, com a small computer terminal designed to observe and manage all action for the Fort Stewart personnel. Accurate to see the data of present status. In case of emergency, can activate it with the all-purpose microchip battery. Please note, uh, it consumes two of pers. No, okay. P Pows, uh, personal activity of service system. Don't consume once in the morning and evening. Importing data concerning health and task progress. Uh, set up in a convenient location throughout the facility when saved. Personnel data is immediately relayed to home country. At least for the time being, right? When I ever, when ever gonna be to say, uh, okay. Worker daily secret file. Okay, we are, we are. Hey, shit. I know this might be like an Asian game or whatnot, but give me a break. Sometimes with the American children or not are actually quite, you know, mixed up too. And also, remember that when you're actually around here, this place. You'd really, really want to get your hands on some maps. Literally, because I'm not going to show you. I mean, when you where the intensive care or not. And believe me, you do want to know where the intensive care is. Why that? I'm not going to be giving spoilers. But when shit hits the fan, you'll see why. And no, you can't take any events for the meanwhile, too. Because otherwise, you'll be dead. Even got another thing here too. Sam, I told you that transforming the transform a room section A of the underground tunnel is connected to the power circuit of the drawbridge. I also told you to be careful when you when you used it, but you screwed up. Now we got unstable voltage, which shut the shut the drawbridge down. Now they'll make us do another maintenance check for the compound. So much getting Christmas off. But thanks, but then again here. Bang in the middle of nowhere. It's exactly much to go on holiday sex or get drunk. Well, that's literally true. In a place like this, uh, this, this compound, think of it. What are you gonna do on a holiday? Dr drink? And then what? Most of the most fun thing to do here would possibly be work. Possibly. Alright. We know that I left something missing over here too, but if I care. 
And yeah, I know that I've been here too, so... Oh yeah! And also... Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, look at that. This car's gonna a lot of fire too. Let's see. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah, it doesn't look nice here. We got bullet marks and blood marks here too, so... That ain't good. Give me a second. Right. So, uh, let's see. Let's so, go, yeah, back to what we're doing here. Yeah, does it like a, uh, a little nuclear proof, uh, tram or what? Probably I might be using, I say, a lot of the first person shooter, because, you know, that's how I roll. Of course, the red dot sight is literally a laser dot sight. And if you're warned about these things here, you know what? You know what I think about these? This! Since then, they're actually bound to be worth destroying because they might be either blocking the way or they might have some interesting loot inside. But if they're used to, let's say, to climb around, then better not destroy them. Use them wisely. Now, how it's to make you paranoid? Just like Grand Theft Auto find, isn't it? Oh, what do you got? Nothing out there. You found out anything? Yeah. The computers are down. Some glitch in the power system. It's nothing I can't fix, though. I'll tell you what, you investigate the area. Sure thing, CO. CO would be standing for a commanding officer. Okay, okay, let's get a move on. Oh, yeah, I can see here that uh, some things are definitely quite a little bit creepy, isn't it? We're gonna expect you from the event. Some crowd just popped out of nowhere and tried to kill us. Can I actually pull the gun outside here? Would you look at that? You can't. Knife? Not even that, too. And then how things are, how things work here. There you go. We got, so we also got another, another little med kit here. Okay, so what do I do with this thing here? Maybe over here at least, database screen? Wait. Nah. Maybe here. Nope, nothing here. I know you can item. Give me item, equipment. Suspension harness. Hmm. Yeah, that one nice. But okay, that's not gonna do anything good here for the time being. Battery. And I got a bin item and just that, and that's that. Okay. I know we're supposed to actually let's say move on to this damn thing here, but uh, not really letting that much, isn't it? I don't know if I'm actually let's say miss something missing something or not. There we go. Um, get actually in the game here. Vibration up, down. Okay, good. No, oh, just screen. The brightness and everything here. Just say okay. Ah, fuck this. One way to reboot the, the sound, I'd say. One more. It's kind of like one of those RPG games, isn't it? Move block by block around. So yeah, I mean, they gotta at least have to figure out how to work things out. We can't do anything yet. I mean, they're like a the the sensor where they're blocking me out. Not much. You can't do that for the time being. For the time being, at least. Nothing out there. You found out anything? Yeah. The computers are down. Hmm. Some glitch in the power system. There's nothing I can't fix, though. Tell you what, you investigate the area. Okay, 
guy with M249 who looks like he's from, let's say, Boston. And this guy here, I don't know, maybe New Orleans? <laughs> I don't know. Wait. Hold on a sec. Uh-huh, hold on. Nothing. Well, yeah, there might be something around here, which I'm gonna say missing somewhat. Can't really tell, I'd say. Can't really tell. Oh, wait. I mean, there's no need to actually go over there, because you know why? Yeah, I mean, that's only the suit water. And believe me, you know, sometimes I actually would want to actually stay a uh, clear water as best as possible. Wanna know why? I'll show you why soon. Really? This actually might be a little bit overwhelming and stupid, but what game character was not were not it was that smart back then, right? Get the healing thing, cause we're gonna need it sooner or later. Okay, another another healing thingy. But of course, the, for the ones that actually worry about the quote-unquote biological violence, no worry. It's not gonna happen time soon here too. The small life form known as the Hydra spews out a green liquid toward the research personnel identified as infestation fluid. This four life form has been known to cling at that regular dog and release that fluid. That's so. Contacted substance will cause some sort of chemical reaction that mutates the body cells. Also degrade the the body's immune cells, immune system in a way that accelerates the cell infestation process. So it's kinda like AIDS in a way. Or I don't know. The, 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 the degenerative fluid has already had an ad adverse effect on the facility personnel. After contact with substance, you are required to uh, proceed immediately to the MTS treatment. Okay. Uh, there are MTS scattered all over facility. Be sure to learn the location of a uh, nearest intensive care unit. Fort Stewart Security Chief. Lieutenant Colonel Greg Howard, the U.S. Army. Right. My, this thing might be actually, might actually, might be, let's say, a, a little batshit stupid or whatnot, but still. Ow, 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 ow. To get rid of the lion spewing forms probably around the facility, I decided to activate a. SG203 sentry gun, automatic interceptor with gun with sensors, beginning at 2 p.m. hours. Since it will shoot anything that sets off the sensor, extreme caution is required. Cause, you know, it's 2005, and things are not really that advanced. No emergency operations can be terminated by the cutting the wire cable shooting, up, shooting or shooting the sensor itself to temporarily disable it. Is it? I don't know. Can't really be too sure. Uh, water. My best friend here, ain't it? And believe me, things here are gonna go amazing. His lock should be able to open it somewhere nearby. Radio? They're a friend or what? Dennis, the sweat answer. Can you get back here? I've worked out the route to the rendezvous point. I'll be right there. Found something, ain't it? Wait, I don't actually actually go against the fire. I'm like, I'm, I'm like little old me, which had nightmares from playing this game. I had. Cause though they have 50 cal on the turrets over there, or, but again, they're like small, so it should be like either 30 cal. Hold on, hold on, hold on. See? Take a look at this right here. The barrel, the empty Browning. Which means that they're 50 cal, but by the side it's small, so it should be like a, a 30 cal, a 308 turret, or it could be also a 762 turret. I don't know. The M4 actually carries a 556, so oh shit. That looks like another thing of. Oh, hey! It's like a vent over there, too. Yay, I got it? Nice. 
the bad thing about these games too is that you can you cannot save on the save screen. Wonder why some bastard actually decided to design the game like that. But to be honest, and I've actually sort of sort to see had some detention or not. What's up? Why you call me in, huh? Uh, come on already. Look, a drawbridge. The map shows huh? that the rendezvous point, B-Wing, is on the other side. We need to lower that drawbridge. We should regroup and find out what's going on ASAP. Okay. Did you find anything out? Well, the compound's in a shambles. <laughs> the hell out of here. Sure. Definitely. Definitely what? Yes, the sharp. You're right. Oh yeah, I've almost repaired the computer. We should be able to open some of the doors now. Can you open the door at the end of the tunnel? It's locked. And need to get through. Yeah, hold on. Yeah, hold on. I like, I like his Boston accent. <laughs> Alright, it should be open now. Yeah, thanks, I'm man. Try to lower the drawbridge from here. We need to leave as soon as possible for the rendezvous point, B Wing. Until then, you look okay. around the area. Amazing place to build underground in the South Pole. Who would have imagined? Hmm, there's certainly something stra strange going on around here. <laughs> okay, let's get a move on. And leave Boston Man uh, working on the computer over there. Come on, get a move on. And time to cut Alright. I don't know if the game actually is crashing off, but give me a second. Right, so I'm back, and uh, okay. Guess my theory, my theory was right. It's actually that, uh, you know, I have to actually go out, hit it and everything. Okay, so with, at least on the keyboard, some things are quite easier. Hey, I made it! A nice big jump like an athlete. Yeah! Would you look at that? No, it, there was actually no reason, no reason for me to go down there, but... Go over there, but yeah. I mean, there's no power and everything, but we know here that everything here seems to be going well. For the time being. Hey! There you go! Haha! <laughs> Nailed it! But yeah, now this is where things get goes to shit. Well, slightly anyways. Yeah, I mean, the little, the little uh, text with the Hydra. Look! There's one! There's one over there! Kill it! Kill it now! No! Oh, can I go? It's gonna get you! It's gonna get you! <laughs> but yeah, I mean that thing. Of course, you let's say it'll give your guard drop up, let your guard drop off, and that thing can literally, can literally just fuck you up when you least expect it. Though all the guns they have their own, let's say their fixed stats and whatnot. Dennis, what? What? I think there's something alive down here. Ah, me too. Be on guard. If we can get the power back on, I can activate the drawbridge. My guess is our breaker's out. There should be a transformer room somewhere. Okay. My job again? <laughs> hey, I'm no good in the cold. So first you send me through the fan, and now I gotta find uh, a trans Stop. <laughs> oh, my God. Don't say if you saw your ass in China. If I hadn't been there. Uh-huh. I would have been chop suey, right? Yada yada yada. I've heard it all before. <laughs> okay, I'll buy you a drink when we get home. You had a nice ass too. Okay, look! Here's one! Here's one! Ooh! Okay, you got one. You didn't know that one yet, but still can see they were there, right? Okay, so might as well just uh, go for that one over there. You can see it there. Be that way then! Oh, fuck me! 
Look at all those motherfuckers over there. There you are. Okay, it's dead. Thankfully. But yeah, I mean, those, 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 those little guys, I mean, they they do some really, they're pretty, pretty fucking vile too, so... Yeah, yeah. But yeah, I mean, you can actually use a knife too, actually, to fight them off or, and so on, but still. Oh. What the hell are you doing? There's someone else I'm missing, or what? Yay, look at that! They know. Oh yeah, because I touched the fire and... Yeah, okay. I mean, there's nothing so too significant to actually... To fix, at least for the time being. At least, but you know what? Let's move on over here! Especially because I really, really don't trust some, some of my things around here, too. Like, you see this puddle of water here, too? Got an attitude. If you stay in a little bit too much, uh, let's say ever if, if you let's say if you stay, let's say in the water, let's say a little too much, you can actually you know, uh, can actually get pretty sick and develop a very very beautiful tu tumor of cancer. No shit, I mean you'll see why, especially in the series uh, when things they really really get bad. Okay, good. Warning, drum can and fuel tanks contain flammable liquids. No shit! Rub me shaking my god if you explode. No shit! Use caution or during transportation or handling. Also, if the drum can gets uh, are arranged in close proximity, ignition of any one may cause a chain reaction. No shit! Oh my god, I never knew that! Yeah, my sarcasm. It's so good it's killing me, man. What's this? Notice all maintenance personnel. Do not transfer a uh, un unexpected car that is loaded with goods on the side of the device. The slide may the slide device may collapse if activated with a load that exceeds the maximum weight limit. Gosh, do you do you uh, use it advised? Okay, we got in. We got, yeah, we got. Uh, okay, there's not much here. Okay, I see. Also, take a look over here. This thing here, you're gonna love it. It's a booster shot. Type A. Slight recovery and of life and immunity. What does that mean about life and immunity? I hope it's not when I push the, the, the triangle button. But let's get out of here. Let's get out of the water, because you know. I know, I mean, I still remember pretty goddamn well that it's in the water. If you stay a little bit too much, you're gonna get fucked in the ass. Not by the little hydras, but they're, I mean, the little hydras, they're pretty, pretty goddamn violent. Can I actually uh, move on now? Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna have to shoot the damn thing. Okay, let's get a move on then. Oh shit, there is just one. Fuck, 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 ow! Yeah, I mean, that's that's actually a, a good start, of course. Moron! Ah, uh, he got wings too! Damn it! Why don't you just focus? Yeah, yeah, I can actually, uh... Okay, I can use a knife too. Like that, but uh, I remember that should die when. Ah, come on! Focus, you asshole! Because you have to actually hit him with the head. That's for damn sure. What you can see over there. Hold on. Okay, twenty percent infection. The green liquids penetrate the thermal coat. It's seeping to my skin. My skin. The pain is unbearable. What do you mean about that? <laughs> we'll see about that. You'll see. So what about this guy here? FS. Okay then. 
Okay. Pretty, pretty graphical, isn't it? But hey, revamp security system. The old pad like, pad like style locks, which were easily broken with army knives or shot from small arms, have been replaced due to security concerns. The Army Deliberation Committee has determined that all locks within the compound will be replaced with car key based devices for improved security. Preparation for the replacement of the locks will begin immediately. Uh, materials will arrive at the schedule around December 23, 2005, which is the year the game happens. Supervising personnel should promptly confirm the contents of delivery upon arrival. Replacement of the locks will begin immediately thereafter. Fort Stewart General. Fort Stewart Security Chief, Lieutenant uh, Colonel Greg Howard, U.S. Army. There you go. Either broken with army knives, right? Going on the human thing here. Excellent. Oh yeah, it's section A. And also keep an eye off. Oh yeah, 20% infected. It's of course better not to even you better keep, keep keep things okay. But believe me, we'll see about how bad things can go. Oh. Um ah. for train maintenance maintenance? Anyways, we I should be able to jump from the carriage to the Alright then, we got we got we should of course be able to make some progress, at least for the time being. But yeah. Play this game here, don't let the green shit hit touch you. Because believe me, you might have pretty some goddamn nightmares afterwards. But I'm gonna but that might be just me anyways. Yeah, you know what, the game's pretty goddamn heavy, I get it. There we go. Finally. Hey, should I be able to jump, of course, right? I mean, I don't remember, of course, if there's like the proper way to do things here, but you know what? Fuck it, I'm doing it anyways. Or... We know there's like the power generator, so... So, yeah... Or maybe it can because it's locked, so you know. So you know, right? Okay, we'll see about here now. Well, what do you, what do you know about that, right? Come the fucking hell on. Ah. Oh, fuck me. Cut, cut! You imbecile! Where do you are? Where, where are they? We'll go over the other, with that one at the other time of the time. To all workers, if infection rises to 100 percent, quick your make quickly make your way to the urgent care unit in the C section or the underground tunnel. You can use a MTS vaccine that dispense at the uh, MTS max treatment system device. Where is that? In accordance with the Fort Stewart Special Directives Article 8, swift uh, disciplinary action. Will be taken against personnel who fail to uh, follow the procedure above. Okay. Because of course, if you let the damn thing like, oh no no, I mean I'm too triggered to actually use the damn thing. Means of course you might be might be shot. So all right. Of course you know the quality of cutscene in this top notch. Eh? Beautiful. Way to go, Dennis. Now we can get to the rendezvous point. I like I like how you have like a very strong Boston accent too. But yeah, if you think of course and things were let's say okay with the power on, brace yourself, alright? Brace yourself, because things are gonna about to get, you know, pretty interesting. How the fucking hell like oh I get it. 
Oh, fuck me. Yeah, now they're after me now. Yeah, fuck you. There's like another one near, nearby here, somewhere. I, I know the damn bastard actually here, somewhere. Ah, uh, some damn bastard. Where'd he go? Oh, that ain't good, man. That ain't good. Fucking hell. He was actually over here somewhere some time ago. Doesn't fucking matter then, doesn't it? Okay, let's get a move on. We got at least one. Hydra, at least one. Oh, good lord. Now, before I actually get a move on, I should probably take the, um, take the opportunity here to actually, uh... No, not to, don't touch the fire, goddammit. Fucking hell, what's wrong with this cunt? What's this guy here? Okay, his face has been chewed off. Yeah. Okay, it's pretty quick too-ish. What do you got here? Recorded by Jim Jorgensen. Now my, now even I've been infected. My cells have been eat up like everybody else. My whole body is racked by excruciating pain. Uh huh. I've now just noted the contact with the water causes an sensation of pain. Oh. Wait. So I'm infected. I should have with water. Okay. Good to know. My guess is this hastens the destruction of body cells. Whenever I saw, I, I think it was the screeching sound of those things in my head. My head things, my head throbs and I'm overcome with a controllable feeling of nausea. I'm unbearable to smell that stuff that they spew out. The idea that would they the idea so they would multiply so ferociously with that such a speed. If only we had some sort of warning for everyone that we beat back. There was a dozen more in a closing in on us. I'm sick and tired of hiding the constant fear of them. I think I'd rather I'd rather just uh just rest here. Uh, maybe I'll just rest right here. And he died. Okay, so what I noticed? Just uh, the uh, wary of the damn bastards. Okay, you know what? I gotta take this one here quite personally, my damn self. Yeah. Fucking fire! Ah, fuck me. I always keep telling myself that I should avoid water, right? Yeah, hurry up now. The damn thing is I say anxious waiting for me up there, too. So, okay. Fucking hell. The damn thing is about to strike. Fucking... Are you fucking kidding me? I'm out of ammo. Maybe you should be better off using my knives or whatnot. Ah, lovely. Set up fire. Was... Okay, good. 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 And to be honest, I'm... Okay. Because there won't be any, say, any, uh... Okay. Okay, I mean, at least what I am, I know at least I'm good. At least. But those bastards, they, they fly around like rats. When you turn your head around, they disappear. Just like that. Or at least expect it to even. So as soon as we get the power back on, I might as well just poke around, see what other supplies I can find out. Hopefully, more ammo. Like, uh, yeah, okay. 20% infected. Nothing. Okay, that happened. Oh, fuck me. What the hell did this guy fly on? Take that, you bastard! Ah, uh, okay, good. Oh, fuck me! Ow, oh, fuck off! I said fuck off already! What the hell? This damn thing doesn't even work! Okay. I... Mm, what the fucking hell? Ah, <sighs> all right.
lights. Goddamn bastard piece of shit got me. Oh, fuck me. Cut him up, will ya? I know I hurt myself. Oh, wait a moment, wait a moment. How much, uh... How much that took? Okay, 80. I can feel dizzy and feverish. I can't get rid of these chills. You know what? I got myself a good idea. Items. Healing items. Okay, that's good. The green liquids. Okay. I mean, it is. I mean, it could be worse too, but still. The only reason I got myself in this mess because I. Ah, fuck me. Car reader beta. Beta key card required needed in, in, in order to open. Uh-huh, okay. So is there anything else I would need? Of course not. But again, why am I 20% infected? It's simple. I let myself. And now this is because of faulty wiring? And because some damn bastards feel like, what's that, oil? Okay, look at that. What are you looking at? Get it out of there. Now remember guys, shit here is about to hit the fence the time soon. Now the damn fire is still on too. And you can see here that the little, uh, that the stench has been active too, so... Might as well just pass underneath it. Yeah, just to uh, run past it and you don't even worry about it. It's even good to have those things around, but still, they can even are the ones that shoot you too. Like the thing you're almost tracking me too, so yikes. Fuck off already, you're dealing with small things. Oh, ow, 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 ow. What the hell are you doing? Christ, your aim is shit for isn't it? Here, down there, you imbecile! Wow. Help me! The Boston man has been attacked! Oh no, oh no, oh. Oh, that's what happened. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck is that thing? Those are his ribs. Roger. Oh. Oh. Why shit? And a hazmat. That didn't take care of shit. I know that for sure. I got 50 rounds on it. Left. Thanks for the M, thanks for the mag at least. Don't move! I had no choice. You were next. What's that supposed to mean? I'm with the Marine Special Recon Forces, right? Uh -huh. I know. You came here to scout the compound. But you're too late. This place is beyond your help. Please listen to what I'm telling you. And get out of here as soon as you can. I wanna know what the hell happened here? What happened to my partner? Ow. What the fuck? Another casualty of this place. It wouldn't help even if you knew. Just get out of here. This area will be taken over any moment now. Taken over any moment? Taken by who? Take this with you! What's that thing? Use this if you don't want to end up like your friends. The antibodies will temporarily ward off infection. Temporarily ward off the infection. Infection? Yeah, I... Your colleagues are in ground level B wing with some survivors. Get to them as soon as you can and go back home. Even a brave marine has to know when to run. Yeah, what about you then, huh? Hey, wait, what the hell are you talking about? What happened here? Tell me! 
Damn it. Damn it. Yeah, I'm not good over there. Roger. Guess what the are those things? I mean, I did a bit of dig into this game, and that guy here is not, uh, let's say, fully well. Max treatment system is to recover from anti infestation immunity. Uh, to recover, okay, recover anti. Christ almighty, look at look at how many of those bastards are there. Okay, good. It's funny how the how a magazine can carry up to a up to 50 rounds of 556. A regular steel stamp the stagnag mags. I got another let's say parts, so let's see if I can I can add up this thing here so. Okay, let's just get a move on. Oh no, don't don't do shit. He's right over there, you imbecile. Oh come on. What the They got some pretty good aim too! There you go, there you go, you bastard. That's one down. Jesus Christ. It's always best to run, I mean, as fast as you can. These guys are pretty goddamn accurate. But yeah, they die, I know they die easy and everything, but I mean... Just because they die easy doesn't mean they die easily, alright? It's best they nest around the house and everything. What's the situation? 60%. Fuck! <sighs> yeah. Yeah, I mean, that happened over there. I mean, of course, not so cinematic-ish, but, you know. Up on the damn thing, will ya? Okay, doesn't matter, because it's already, it's already okay. Good, good. <sighs> Alright, that's good. Look at this, look at this guy here! That's his rib cage open over there! And that thing in the middle, those tentacles too! Holy shit! And again... Uh... You wouldn't mind tell- What the fuck? Look at that face over there! Even if you feel like a mobile, I mean, just take a screenshot and, you know, uh... Put it upside down so you can have a look at his face too! Mind telling me which way is your M249? Or not, doesn't matter. Holy shit, let's get out, let's get the hell out of here. Okay, and the damn bridge went back up. The bridge went back up, eh? Can't go back there anymore. But why did it go but, but, but why did it go back? Oh for fuck's sake. Oh my god, this guy. You could do that, you shit! Got him. Oh, fuck me. Yeah, because those things, I mean, as much as uh, we really, really hate these guys, they're pretty fucking... Vi vicious too. Intensive care unit. Good. Fucking amazing. Okay. Sure. I'd like to save you, all right. I know I'm 50% infected, but you know, I mean, 60% infected, mind you. An emergency containment procedures handbook is available as a reference in event no problem. A current dangerous uh, substance under research uh, here at Fort Stewart. If any symptoms of contamination observed uh, of use of an 8M uh, MTS vaccine is vital. MTS. Maximum treatment system. Developed independently of a disease uh, and epidemics corpse of the U.S. Army. Use of vaccine cocktails to efficiently treat all types of infectious diseases. Treat all infectious diseases. Note, MTS vaccines are currently the most powerful vaccines available. But they're not permanent. That's the thing. In addition to restoring immune system, they are very effective in breaking off infested cells in accordance with Fort Stewart regulations. All researchers are required to uh, carry on their on person minimum one MTS vaccine at all times. That's one in the minimum. Fuck me. Okay. 
we now that's even more of these stuff, even more of these things around? Because you know, how do you know? Where's the world? Wow, like a little bit of storage box here. Intensive care unit, lovely. That's what we need. Lovely. Cannot use that item now. Okay, good. Remember, always keep one of these things on yourselves. Minute munition storage. High standard. Uh, Oh wait, standard rifle ammunition, NATO ammo, is uh, stored in ammunition storage in case of infiltration or compound in enemy country or an assault by terrorist forces. Okay. The ammunition storage will open in the event of emergency, allowing personnel to arm themselves and much ammunition they can carry. Permission from the compound security division is, is required before entering the ammunition storehouse. But I'm spec ops, so alright. Ah, here we go. Yeah, all right. Nice. 200 ammo. Can't carry any further. Oh, come on already. Now, I might as well just uh, get myself treated before I have to submit you guys to some more horrific uh, things. Okay, you know what? Fuck this. Might as well just do it anyways. Because, you know... Good, you know. And yeah, this is like a horror RPG thing, so alright. What the f- Items. Yeah. Just so I can, you know, get together these things. Nice. Of course, always good to give themselves the minimum one time and whatnot, but still. Even though it's not to say a full, let's say, uh... Oh, you bad, alright. Memory card 1, alright. I'll save it on this on this one, yeah. I'll save, of course, uh... On all the things as I can... Along the way. Nice. We're up to 6 again. Excellent. Now, I mean, of course, some people, uh, you know, when they see what the game actually happens, I believe some kettles might actually, let's say, would want to actually live inside the intensive treatment system here, but, you know, it wouldn't, it wouldn't really ca happen, cost for much because you would need at least one of the damn things. Let's go into the deep, dark, and known. We're at the section C. Yeah. Well, yes, uh, uh, don't worry. It's actually the same place as before. Please tell me there's a vaccine. Yes. It looks like a it looks like a small cigar, but you know, unlike they unlike you know the cheap cigars, the cigar actually the cigarette can actually save your life. And no, uh, smoke. And yes, smoking is bad. But this year you're not smoking. And holy shit, the guy's fucked. I mean, thing should be if you. Okay, look at that. They're gone already. Almost immediately, to be honest. What happened with this guy? Okay. Okay, his intestines are eaten out, and his eyeball is exposed too. Now, if you think, of course, this game actually can be a little too graphic or whatnot, think with me this way. Just think with me this way. If you think it's too too graphical, if you think if it's too graphical. Just imagine if this mother if this motherfucking game was made today. It would be like fucking Outlast with it like a M4 or what? I don't know. Fort Stewart Special Directives Article 14. In event of the biohazard shutters uh, have cooled down and blocked off the tunnel, permission of a senior officer must be granted before operating the shutters. And a caution is necessary before using the switch. Okay. Nothing here. Of course, some people say it might be unhealthy to even open up these boxes and whatnot. Okay, that would be very much preferable if the damn flame bag would work! Uh, 
Come on. Come on. There we go. You can see here, here's the map. Mm-hmm. So where are we now? And let's say we're not here in the ground storage D area. Okay. So I mean tell this better than nothing, I guess. Recorded by Jim Jorgensen. I can't even hazard a guess at how many of those things are right, multiplied. There must be a hundred times that those things this thing actually see. I estimate the whole compound is being overrun within within the eighteen hours. I give anything to get out of this place, but there's no chance of the snowstorm. I am a dead man. I'm either, either way I'm a dead man. I can freeze to death outside or die in here. Well, oh, fuck me. Now, I'm not gonna open them just yet. I mean, oh, fuck me. On the bright side, just two of these guys. But, you know, but still, you know. I best to steer to steer clear these these are little pricks too. Look at that little asshole over there, you see? I know how explosive my my knife is. I mean after all it was made by quote unquote uh, shrapnel and uh Okay, this is a thing now. Whatever this goopy mushy thing is and blocking out the door. Okay, we'll see how it goes over time, I guess. Oh fuck me. At least you have two of those bastards over there. Okay, you wanna you wanna go, huh? Yeah, here said me this, you bastard. I'm gonna I shot at your little friend, you're next. The knives, of course, actually be way better to take care of these guys, but for one, I mean, I can actually try and everything, but still, these guys... It means because, you know, these little hydras, they're pretty goddamn vicious, too. Not even close! And that motherfucker's about to fly. Okay, cut him up! No! Fucking fly off! I mean, I don't really want to witch. There you go. Ah! Hey, there, you bastard. Things, of course, can definitely get way worse. Oh, trust me, they definitely can. Should have saved the other, the other thing, of course, the blue one with the chip inside thing. Now remember, guys. I think I might go actually go. Oh, it's spinning. Which means I think I'm gonna stay over here. Okay, you ready? Off we go then. I said off we go then. Stay out of the way. Okay. Even the damn train didn't escape too. Get the fuck out of the way then! What is this asshole doing? Okay, look at that. He's flammable stuff. What is he doing? It's coming right over there too. Okay, I can actually move on. Jesus Christ Almighty! Oh, fuck me! You know, I can barely even see the red outside, to be honest, too. It's funny, all too, even if the, uh... Oh, would you look at that bastard? Oh, look at that bastard over there, too. 
Yeah, you're pretty goddamn smart, all right. Can I can move on? Fucking frame rate trying to get me killed, isn't it? Yeah. No wonder the damn thing. The damn frame rate trying to get me killed too. Oh fuck me! Now even more of those. Oh, these pricks you too. What's this here? Okay. Okay, at least I'm good here for the time being. But I did, but that, but that ain't, of course, that's the only thing I can actually die off. But yeah, better leave him be. I know they're not attacking me yet, but still, I know what? Fuck this guy! I said, fuck him! You don't even know what me. What does that mean? Fucking hell! Oh, come on already. You're gonna attack me too, huh? Okay, I get it. You little shit. Okay, even another this goddamn cockroach too. Yeah, another one. Fuck me! I just dodged two without even knowing it. Die! I hate him so goddamn much. You little bastard. Fucking sense tell you, little leech. What is frame rate? Jesus Christ almighty. Sure, I know there might be some other, let's say, uh, emulator or not, but this one they got the best on me for now. So, yeah. Fucking kill him already, will ya? My goodness, already worked for Barley. The damn thing is that running at at least 24 frames per second, even Grand Theft Auto 5 got a whole lot more performance than this shit. Fucking shoot! Now finally too. Ah, uh, can't the damn things at least have, have something good in, in them or what? And at least a note, something. Oh, come on. Whoa. You know, can I can I can I can I just like, stomp these things? Okay. Those things are you know bound to attack me time soon and Okay, that took four of that. Maybe that was a bit of a bad idea, but let's get a move on. It seemed to deep in the, into the dark unknown, right? <sighs> Emergency sequence activated. A research level one doors, huh? Wait a second. What's in that? Yeah, of course I know that, uh, over the time when I- Ah, uh, great. Fuck off! Take that, you bastard. But even though that didn't do jack shit, too. I mean, I mean, why the fuck would even do? Seriously, why would the fuck even do something? Ah, you fucking asshole! I haven't told how much I hate these things. Oh, even another one up here, huh? Okay. Tell you the word grenade is not want you those shit. Fucking kill him. He's over there. What the? F okay. To begin to be honest, this thing here actually was much, much easier in the previous version I played. One knife strike was at least enough to kill these damn things. 
And I know they can even upgrade over time or not, so you can see how well things are gonna go, too, so alright. I mean, if I could jump, that'd be much more preferable, but hey! Screw me, right? Look at the bass over there, too. Just kick him down, will ya? Kick him down! Oh, is that just something good? Please do something good. Really? Okay. I'll take it. I guess it could be worse, right? In the little cage over here, too. Lady! You owe me an explanation, goddammit! Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Paper Shit, Tony. You! I'm going to ground level B Wing. How do I get there? You're still here? Use the elevator. Elevator? Elevator? What's an elevator? Nine seven. That fucking pen doesn't even fucking work. Okay, one nine. Oh fuck me! A damn fan is like. Okay, good. Everything's here clear for far. So for now. One nine seven. Okay. Okay, I have to take the take the paper, pen, and paper here. Fucking Jesus Christ Almighty, the damn thing is covering the damn thing here. Okay, 197. You can barely scratch the damn thing here. Okay, it's 197. Four. Well, finally, some goddamn ink comes out, the damn pen. Nine. One. Okay, 1974. Oh. Two. One, five. Really poorly written, but all right. Unless well, it's uh, the other way around. Five, one, two, zero, four, seven, nine, one. They didn't even didn't even think of this through how that down did they? Warning notice: advanced corrosion in the in the, uh, in the power in the has really the power outage in some of the facilities. Once you've the deck areas, be sure to use a flashlight to check your grip. TG attach your assault rifle and proceed with extreme caution as. You continue patrolling, and keep in mind that the small life form known as Hydra appears to favor dark places. Oh, I'll keep that in mind, all right. Fuck off. I really don't want. Let's just, I really don't like shooting these guys here because you know, for if you know what I know. These things are vicious, I'll tell you that! Next up is damn thing! Good! Get up, will ya? Yeah, that little bastard over there, too! Oh, fuck off, Freddy! Nice how good things are to play around a uh, in a emulator, right? 
how good things can get. You know what? Do I even need to try? Oh, probably so. What the? Asshole! This is good now, doesn't it, you little shit? Motherfucker! It's locked. Well, oh shit, right? Seems like a vaccine over there too. Wait, who was the asshole who locked the damn thing? I didn't bump him that he did, I see. Okay, can I move on now? Wait a moment. Are you fucking kidding me? He's actually going towards me. Damn bastard, even shit the damn thing just 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 switch targets, huh? Fuck off. Jesus Christ. Eat me, die, you bastard! That's not really gonna end well, isn't it? Really hate the damn thing a lot. That's what I. That's what I for sure. What the? You completed that. Um, damn! Fuck! Wanted the flesh come out. I mean, I'm really. I mean, it makes me happy because at least the damn bastard dead. Oh, good lord. Even more damn fuckers here the other round yet, though. He's attacking me, but thankfully he failed. I'm kinda curious to know what's on the other side here, too. I really. Get up, get up, get up. I have to like something. Oh, okay. Are you fucking kidding me? Fine then, be that way. What does that mean over there? Probably a lot of one of those things over there or what? Great, and them best side over here would be a good thing a good place to put one of your shit over there around, yeah? I can't really tell what I'm doing over here, but I'm doing something. Okay. Can we go down like you now? Ah, uh, god damn it. Ah, uh, yes. More ammo. How bad am I now? Let's see. 50. Fucking cunt! I am fucked. <sighs> oh well. Can you pick up the damn mo the little mo the motherfucker on the ground? Okay, good to know. Break the damn lock, will ya? That's just glitching to the damn wall here, too. There we go. Uh-huh. Uh-huh, okay. Be that way, then.
You little shit! Get back here, you! Uh. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Fucking shoot him for the motherfucker's story, you brainiac! There we go, finally. One, two, three. Fucking there you go, nothing. Oh, I made it. Holy shit. What the fuck was all that about? Uh huh. Great, we just aggravated one, one, one of those things over there. Ah, oh, come on. Fucking shit! Bang! Ah, if I swear I get this, I get the uh, copyright to this game here, and I, and I swear to Christ, I would actually clean it all up or not. Wait, what's this here? Okay. Control tower. Okay, I don't know what's this here about, but alright. It's actually not the place that I'm in, so... Okay, so what the hell would I even care about, huh? What's this? Okay, Robert Cameron. Ever since he got sprayed with that disgusting green liquid, those damn cockroaches spew out. As if I saw her back in my back, a slice into my inner like a hunting knife. Uh-huh. It's developed some kind of boil, and it swelled. Any contact with what I call the deadly surge through my body. What the hell has happened to me? This compound's supposed to be teeming with scientists, but I can hardly see a single one. The compound security won't even give, give uh, won't even give me the first idea. What's going on? As far as they made a pack not to open your stupid mouths. What the hell? What, just what's going on here? And, uh, and is this why... This is why I never wanted you to come in such an out-of-the-way place. Regrets won't even help me, though. Yeah, an engineer to, to you, to be honest. What's this thing? Uh oh. Okay, that helps a lot. I think. Because yeah, we have to go back there to actually deal with things and it's locked you, bl you blind idiot it, it's locked fast can't you damn ride you blind idiot we got nothing over here no supplies nothing okay oh fuck me Wait a moment. Nothing here. <coughs> and I got a goddamn hiccup from the hell now. Car reader alpha. I need a car reader alpha to open up the damn thing. Could you open the damn, get the damn thing? Ah, fuck me. Okay, please your keys. Fort Stewart Special Directive Article 3. All research personnel employed at Fort Stewart will be given free cards, which should be carried with them at all times. There are two keys of key cards. Ah. The alpha key card and the beta key card are located according to the rank of the of the pair. Key card loss or damage will be the cause of disciplinary action. Okay. No upgrade here. I thought it would be at least in something. But hey, I mean, the fucking hell can I do, right? That's the control tower. Why oh, you stop stuck at that thing? Oh, it's one. It's just one thing. 
How about uh, this thing? You know, wait. Not gonna hell the damn. Stand still, you asshole! Let me get the damn thing. What's this? Shotgun shells. Shotgun units. Okay, thanks. I guess. There's a thing over here. F uh, Fort Stewart uh, Special Directives Article 18. In case of an emergency security situation, the level 1 entrance the door to the research whatever will be locked automatically. Okay, good to know. Oh, are you kidding? Are you kidding me, right? If I get the damn thing on at all times, right? But no. Okay, another one of these things. Okay, so I'm I'm glad I actually got. Oh, what the fucking hell? Apple. What the fuck is that thing? What the hell? Okay. Holy fuck. I should get, I should get myself a shotgun unit right about uh, now. Maybe. Those things are literally everywhere. Jesus fucking Christ, I can't see shit. Hey, no, no, no. There's like about five of those things at me. At least five in the minimum. What the hell now, these things? Okay, by Arnie Hartman. This morning I woke up the sound of something crawling to the ceiling and I couldn't move a mouse. It could have been a mouse. None of this could survive extreme and tragic cold. So what could have been? At this time I heard it more clearly at this um, at almost sound of a churning mucus. At a low, sickening... Wait, what? Sickening moan. Uh-oh. That... That doesn't actually sound good because these things like do like a... Like a hit song, like <laughs> Something like that. But a moan like, something like that. So it means it could actually be something really worse. And something actually gonna fill me in and I'm like, okay. Actually, oh. oh, we're back here, okay. But isn't someone actually gonna fill me in like, uh, what the fuck is this thing here? I put my dick in it if I could. <laughs> okay. Wait, I know this the ship like a Oh, I get it. No, I don't get it, but alright. Let's get a move on. No. Bad. Oh, just swim them now. Now's not the time for that. Are those his friggin' intestines or what? Yeah, that'd be gone. Then again, it wouldn't really matter, matter much if I keep myself on single rounds or whatnot. Here we are, the control tower. Oh! Gotta recover you. Nice, nice. Thanks. Those things are literally everywhere. No fucking wire that covering my side line of sight. Are you 
fucking kidding me. You asshole! Okay, I was running at the damn thing. Now the frame rate is trying to get me killed, as usual. Remember, guys. Uh, nope. Let's see what the damn thing. Die already. I fucking hate you. Sure, yeah, of course all the all these things here can actually get better at over time and whatnot, but still. But still I'm, what the fucking hell, the damn water is electrocuted electrified. You know, I can actually climb up the damn thing personally, but hey, rule the game. Yay, look at that. Get up on the damn thing now, will ya? Fort uh, Seward Special Directives. Entrance into the maximum security area from the lower levels of the control tower are main securely sealed during the emergency in until instructions arrive from pers top ranking personnel. Okay, that's good to know. Scram! Don't tell me! Uh-huh. Okay, six so you're fine at level one. Level one for your eyes only. Fort Steward Manual has okay, a compartial uh, access control system and installed in the Fort Steward facility for the purpose of security protection. Normal access compartments is determined by the security level of the key cards card keys of help with personnel. Access to research area compartments is automatically blocked whenever the system detects the deviations of the physical and environmental norms. If movement remains unblocked for F even after the abnormal situation has been restored to normal, the block may be lifted at a manual control terminal to get powered upon approval of security. Okay. Uh, no. For manual lifting of the block, a password must be held by personnel that the appropriate security level is required. <sighs> yeah, nope. Okay, here's the door. Oh, must be vaccine, 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 vaccine. Good. Yay. Yay. Okay, good. Let at least in here be safe. Yeah, I mean, I, what what do I have to lose too? The control tower. What's this here? Get the damn thing, will will ya? Recorded by Robert Cameron. It just occurred to me the last week when they when they did the compound inspection. Security officers went transporting somebody to research level one. My hunch that they were delivering a part for arms. And it's as if they knew that things might turn out like this. I hope I'm wrong though. Reminded by engineer Robert. And I wonder if even let's say Telltale Games actually would uh, even let's say take interest in this game. I wonder actually kind of story they actually poke around with this thing. I don't know, probably something very nightmarish or what. I don't know. Let it be ammo. Huh, okay. Okay, good. Secure lock, enter ID code. Okay, let's go for... Okay, has to be like this, huh? Okay, be that way. One... How to get up? Okay. Nine. <sighs> Seven. 
four, zero, two, one, five. Okay. Error. And the correct ID code. Okay. Uh, security lock, enter ID. ID code. If not, I can either Google up the internet or not, but alright. Five. One. Two. Zero. Four. Seven. Nine. One. ID code. Okay, good. Please wait. Don't fuck me over. Security lock cancelled. Level 1 now accessible. Fucking amazing. <sighs> Shit. I'm not sure that was something, wasn't it? Fucking cunt. I thought I already powered the damn thing already, but alright. I mean, I should have waited because at least in here would be like a safe, would it be like a safe spot? For the moment, that is. Okay, no, watch for fuck that thing. Fuck you, and fuck you. You can hit with a knife, but you know. No, they're like, gonna want to even replace that other dude over there, too. I don't know what those things are, but fucking hell! Cut him! There you go! Eat, eat, eat that, you bastard! Good lord. What's this thing? Dog tags. Okay, this is in the Recon Troops Arthur McDonald. McDonald. Lance Corporal. So he only found his dog tag. But where's the body, right? He's not here! So which means that either something really bad must have happened. I'll try not to think about it. There you go. Can't I at least... Uh, I mean, if I could, at least I set my... I kicked the damn thing around. Out of China. Ah! Can't do nothing about those guys on the wall. They're, uh, let's say isolated by themselves over there. I can't really tell what, what those things over there too, and yeah, here's all you want. Damn bastard! Please fall off. Yes, thank you! And then again, the good thing is I can actually have the up top here. And hey, look at that, there's something up top here too. Out of the way, faggots! Ah, good. Another back scene. Yay! Okay, good to know. What the hell was the point of this then? You imbecile! Okay. What's this thing? Okay, by Michael Vadam. Uh, those bugs have found their way into the control tower. That green slime spew out and infests the surfaces. And it forms them. <coughs> it's like the supercomputer area. It's it, it, this is like the supercomputer area that essentially controls the whole compound. If those bugs get to, the, get to this, what will happen to the rest of the compound? The worst thing is, if they destroy the circuit that uh, heat the system, the whole place will drop to 20 below, freezing less than 2 hours. The rescue team would never make it in time. HQ even said that uh, HQ, HQ still haven't come up with any info. What the hell are they hiding? Love from engineer Michael. Michael Vadam, right? Oh, fuck off, you little, you little cockroach. Ah, I am not happy. Oh, look at that, they even, they even corrupted the entire the other place here too. But no, but no worries, I can at least get, take care of myself. You bitch, even shot me in the foot too.
Good lord. One, two, three, and off we go. Ah, there we go. Christ almighty. No one will actually know how much I hate these little guys. I know section B where we started, but still, I mean, need to hurry and... Okay, now that thing over there is actually a uh, fucking all. Fucking bastard. I have no clue where this leads to, but I'm gonna take it in anyways. There you go. And yeah, well that thing over there, you know, for the one that, that I... And now I can even at least spew out more of those things over there too. I don't have any other weapon that could fight him off, and no, no, no. That'd be a little too, way too easy now, wouldn't it? Can I get it to go down now? You can see over there, I mean, that blue thing there. I guess if I ever had any, at least some ammo over there too. And at least some dignity too. So what have we got? <sighs> okay, you know what? Fuck this, fuck you, fuck that, fuck everything. Okay, that's not exactly what it worth. That could have, it definitely would be way worse too. Ah, let me go! Not even ammo, right? Only at least uh, damn below actually got you know, up with the damn thing and at least it dropped the monk dropped them and they actually killed them too. But oh no no, it's never that easy now, isn't it? Oh hell. Hmm. <sighs> So I wonder what else could happen that can actually go wrong, too. Yeah, good to know. I do hope that I hope they didn't displace everything here, too, because. Good Jesus Christ. Bunch of wires over here. <sighs> so what the hell is all this here about? Please be ammo. Oh, shotgun shells. I mean, it know it's good and everything, but I have a bit of a question. How the fucking hell am I supposed to use a shotgun right now? Clearly there's no way to actually know, isn't there? Okay, there's nothing I can Oh, yes, what's this? What's this, what's this, what's this? What's this? Oh, yes, I need the damn thing. There we go. At least uh, it should it should be more, a little bit more accurate at least because as you can see here now, guess what? I can actually zoom in and zoom out. Okay. Oh. Wait. Wait a moment. Okay. This one? Okay. Oh, L1 and L2. There you go. Now it works. Now it works just like a charm, too. Ah, finally. Finally, alright. Now, how's that lady? You have a lot of things to explain yourself. You're okay. Hmm. So, it was you 
Cindy? I've been worried about you. I haven't been able to contact you ever since that day. <laughs> Dennis. Dennis. Your being here is just a coincidence. Or whatever. I don't have anything left to say to you. Just leave me alone. Wow. Oh. I'm here on a mission, but I knew you were here. So of course I was worried about you. Do you understand what you did? I'm telling you, I have nothing more to say. Let's talk about it later. I need some information here. Just what happened to this compound? What's going on here? Why did the military send your team instead of just bombing the place? This base is a lost cause. It can't be saved. Not even by you, mighty Marine. The Pentagon misjudged this one. Hmm. How do those monsters' bugs fit in? This place could be the beginning of the world's very extinction. Oh. You don't know what you're dealing with. If it doesn't stop, the human race will be wiped out. Uh huh. Hurry up and get to ground level B wing. Go back home with your colleagues. And tell your military that their dirty little plan has become a nightmare. This place to the ground. What will you do? Over business to attend to. Take this key card. You can make it above ground with this. Use it to turn on the elevator in uh -huh. the underground storage area. Go. You've got to find your team, haven't you? Dennis. I'm sorry. That's yeah, alright. Roger. I know. I still can't believe it. Cindy, I'll wait for you to make it back to B Wing. So, in case you. Okay, got the Alpha key card. A card for our Type A card readers. But of course, if, you, if you're wondering what was the story between those guys, they're like uh, this couple, I mean, Roger and Cindy. So Cindy works as a scientist, as a military scientist, as a guy that Roger writes. Roger's best friend of Dennis and... And uh... No, no, no. no Roger was actually the guy with the, with the M249, the, with the Boston accent. Uh, no, it's actually not the other guy. I mean, it was Cindy's husband too. That You know, he was, uh, it was the same thing that guy. But of course, when they're fighting, they literally got themselves in some, let's say, heated up shit. And I, I don't remember actually well, I mean... If you know her husband was actually the sick caught in a bombing, which turned into a piece of charcoal, or if he was if he were led like a like a Swiss cheese, but even but even that, I mean, you can actually see, I mean, how things kind of are. Uh, so yeah, I mean, even you know, Cindy holds like the grudge that would happen, and I mean, only now that she knows that she realized it about Roger, you know, the guy who got attacked with the little cockroach then turned to a fleshy Hulk. Whatever that, whatever the hell that thing is. And yes, I know, I got no ammo left. Hooray, hooray, right? Totally the best thing ever. What's this? Yes, good. That's what I need. Yeah, here we go. We got us like a NM4 or SPR4 in that case. With a attachment, with a... Uh... Okay, good, good. Good. We got as well as here like uh, 18 rounds, but no, but no 556. Five, so, ain't the world a charm, right? So, what do you think of it now? Am I one of the cool kids now? Huh? 
<laughs> but yeah, let's just get a move on. Alright, before I should get a move on, man, I definitely should get some, some more ammo, that's for damn sure. To be honest, I don't even remember what button I used for the damn thing here, but uh, alright. At least the bright side, I mean, at, at least, uh, instead of depending on the, on the aim here, which there was no such thing as a red dot sight, I can actually, of course, have this thing here actually to work with me now. Ah, oh, god damn, the damn thing is... Okay, here you go. I, I, I remember now. Okay, let's see how, let's see how, let's see, let's at least of course let's uh, get the damn thing unlocked. Then I'm gonna go ahead and head back and uh, see what I can do. Okay. That opened that up and uh, I got a really bad feeling about this. What the? What the fuck is that thing? I know this damn thing. Hey, stay the hell away from me! Those little, those little things, of course, are actually going to let's say, uh, be you and his friend and stay around and whatnot. But okay, how about anywhere but going near that thing again, huh? Like the ladder, yeah. There you go, good boy. Use the ladder. Of course, I think they're gonna try to attack me, or whatnot. But still, um, that thing ain't dumb. I'll tell you that. What the fuck are those things? I know they're called hydras. Or at least that's, that's the scientific term of these things, but fucking hell. Yeah. You can see that maybe that was little, uh. Maybe that was Donald? Last Grand Pro Donald, maybe? I know, because you can see, like, damn, let's say, thing is locked, is locked on to the like, chest thing, like, it's hard, so. You know what? Fuck this. I'm gonna head back and get myself some ammo or whatnot, because, uh. You know. Going forward, it's just it's still suicide, so. And why do you can't get with this side? That's what I want to know. Doesn't matter. It don't matter, I'd say. Ba -ba at least I'm still alive. We got something that counts, at least. Better not keep keep on see cutting up the damn things. Making my way through. Don't even mind those things. Let's just uh quote-unquote, speed run it, right? And for fuck's sake, stop destroying the boxes, because I know what, I, I know damn well what those they, what they're gonna lead me to. There we go. Jesus Christ. That good section B. At least, um, at least uh, the way, the reason why I backtrack is because of you know the intensive care treatment here. First off, I'm gonna get the damn thing off me. Secondly, I'm gonna get myself some more ammo. Yeah, yeah, that's what I get. That's what I need for damn sure. It's always good, of course, to keep one of those things. I mean, especially for a lot of good. <coughs> A good reason why. I would need myself a much bigger battery pack. That's for <coughs> that's for damn sure. Now, of course, it's like a a fictional 2002, 2000 uh, game, whatnot. And yeah, I know that even I uh, even was even stupid enough to even play this game as a kid and still get myself what what I got and know the nightmares afterwards. 250. So the more the, the more magazines I collect, the more ammo I can carry. That it? I mean, I I only remember carrying up to 200. Well, guess I was wrong at some point. But still, let's just get a move on. You're supposed to open the door, not blast it open. 
Christ almighty. There we go. Finally. Yeah. Intensive care. Control tower. Here. At least here will be well better. But yeah, so then again, I hope you enjoyed as much as, as much as I did. And look forward to the next one. So I will see you next time. You know, till then. And remember, if you think this game is a nightmare, then it's just beginning.